Photographing an article for Food Network magazine, and it's all about cheese, making lots of recipes with cheese. So I thought, what's the quintessential cheese recipe? It's grilled cheese sandwiches. I've got just a very simple Pullman loaf, good bakery loaf, not like the stuff from the grocery store. So I'm gonna need one cup of mayonnaise, a quarter of a cup of mustard, I use good Dijon mustard. And this is the unusual ingredient, Parmesan cheese. Quarter of a cup of Parmesan cheese. I think that works best. And just whisk it all together. And I'm gonna spread this on the bread before I even put the cheese in. I mean, how bad could that be? Okay, that's done. But first, I'm gonna spread some butter on the bread. And that's gonna make sure it's gonna be nice and brown and crisp when it goes into the grill pan or the press. Okay, so that's the butter. Now I'm just gonna flip them all over. You want the butter on the outside of the sandwich. And then I'm gonna spread the inside with the mustard and mayonnaise mixture. I find a spoon for this, an easier way to spread it on. So inside of this, I'm gonna put really good cheese, some crumbled bacon, and put it in a panini press. If you don't have a panini press, you can always do it in a saute pan, just like classic grilled cheese sandwich. Okay, now for the bacon. I think the easiest way to cook bacon is in the oven. On a rack, 400 degrees, 20 to 30 minutes, it comes out perfectly every time. Okay, I'm just gonna put it on the board and just dice it up. Every sandwich gets just a little bit. And just give this a big dice. Just big pieces like that. It's easier to distribute on the sandwiches. Okay, that's the bacon. I'm just gonna put a few pieces on each sandwich. It's a cheese sandwich, not a bacon sandwich. Just adds a little extra flavor. Now we need cheese. I need six ounces of cheddar. That should be about six ounces right here. And I need six ounces of Gruyere. I love Gruyere for this because it's got this really nutty flavor. So the fastest way I know to grate cheese in the food processor. Watch this, it's so fast, I love it. Just put it right in the feed tube. Can't get it all in. Yeah, I can. And that's the cheese. So I'm just gonna put lots of cheese on each one. Just pile it up. Remember, it's all gonna melt together. And only on half the bread slices. Then I'm just gonna take the tops and put them on the bottoms. These are major grilled cheese sandwiches. So I'm gonna do two sandwiches at a time. It takes about three to five minutes. It'll be nice and browned on both sides. Love the sizzle. And when I'm done with this, I'm gonna take them all outside and we're gonna photograph them in the garden. Just grab that one branch and pull it across mm -hmm. that way a little bit. There you go, that way, that's it, that's good. 